Final Fantasy 13 2, the story so far. Sarah! I shall remember your pain. No! What's wrong? Why won't you answer me? And then we get stabbed by Caius, and then we go sent to Dream World, then we snap out of it, and then we snap Noel out of his Dream World, and then get Mog back, and we end up here. And we're all like, we have the resolve, we're gonna go do this. All caught up. Thanks, story so far. Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIII 2 for most likely the fi finale. Uh, we'll still be doing post-game stuff after, but... Yeah, th this should be the finale, and we have almost every fragment in the game. 143 of 160. And the ones I'm missing, I, I physically cannot get yet. Uh, I think. So, that's where we stand with that. I have my big good weapons, o Odin Blade, Odin Bolt. Got my delicate marks and stuff. We're pretty much over-leveled. In fact... Yeah, yeah. We're we're almost completely maxed on the Crystarium too. Twenty twenty-nine left. We might actually finish this at the end of the game, most likely. So, I'm done with that. We have our triple chocobo party, so I th I think we're all set. The time foretold in the prophecies is here at last. It is five hundred AF and the crystal pillar that supports Cocoon is starting to crumble. The people of Academia have been evacuated to the new Cocoon. Now all that remains is to launch the Ark into the sky. It is the moment of reckoning. Destruction and rebirth hang in the balance. Two futures, two possibilities, and a battle to determine the fate of the world. So everyone's already in the new Cocoon. That's unfortunate, especially since they have the knowledge that Caius wants to crash cocoons into each other. Oh. I'm just gonna let it play out. It's so loud I don't wanna I don't wanna talk over it. The last episode, Promised Eternity, Academia. Not my last episode, but 500 AF. Look, it's like it's turning into Valhalla. We're at the time of the prophecy. The pillar is going to crumble any moment, and then the old cocoon will fall. I don't see any of the people. I think they've already been evacuated. Yeah, everyone must be in the Ark. Wait! I bet that's Caius's target. Exactly. <laughs> this must be the moment that Hope launches his new cocoon. Right? <laughs> Didn't you guys hear uh, narrator lady? <laughs> Labyrinth of Chaos. The roads of Academia 500 AF are infused with chaos. When a path ends, jump across it. If you fall, you'll be sent back to the starting point. Oh, <laughs> that's... Uh, no, no invisible walls in this, this episode. If you find yourself having trouble, try obtaining the fragment skill. Yeah, jump further. Checkpoints are Cactar statues. Okay. What's going on? Bursts of chaos are warping reality to us. This energy is leaking in from Valhalla. We have to stop Caius fast. We sure do. Oh, and we have the gate seal for this place already. I think. All oh, right, this this place is like, it, it still kind of reminds me of the end of thirteen. You look way too serious. It's like you're about to head off to a final showdown with your nemesis or something. If that's the case, you should spend an absurd amount of gil at my shop. It might help you win. Come on, uh, lighten up and pull that gil out of your wallet. Chocolina, I have five gil. Literally five gil. The most I could do. Oh yeah, yeah. We 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 really can't even sell anything. Nothing's worth any money. 
Uh, okay. What do you have anyways? Okay, long Gui backpack. Sure. Oh, you're selling engines and boosters and essence. Those are worth a lot. Okay, new delicate stuff, new boat, new weapons. Are not stronger than my fragment weapons. Izanami. Hmm. That's okay. Thank you. It doesn't matter whether you win or lose. The only thing that matters is whether I win or lose in this game called life. You're so honest. Okay. So we have to map this whole place and go turn that in after. Which means I'll probably have to go find Watch. random blocks. If you follow the movements closely, stand on. you can see there's some sort of pattern. Uh, if we get the pattern down, we can get past them. Sure. Sure. Uh, no, no, I have to go grab that. Uh, I kind of hope we get a map here. Maybe, maybe this is a map. Nope, Phoenix down. Great. Well, uh, gotta step over there. There, it's all it's all mapped. We're good to go. Uh, left, maybe. Wow. At least it stays just long. Or no, no, no. It, it gives you plenty of time. <laughs> They're tiny. Yeoman. Okay. I can't believe I did all this grinding without going to the final area. I actually think I remember these things being quite difficult, too. Like, like they hit really hard. They had a lot of health. Not, not so much anymore. Hey, we got one. Okay, that just came up. Don't you turn. <sighs> Alright, this is going to be an awkward place to map. I'm just going to kind of get to the end. And... I'll go back and map what I have to. This... This is totally turning. No! <laughs> oh, that was close. Oh, good. Thank you. Alright, let's see. Yeah, which means I have to go off to these little sides and everything. It's not that big, honestly. It's just complicated to navigate correctly. Okay, yeah, you're, we can't take that path. That's clearly not going to work. Is this one turn? Okay. Um... Actually, I'm going to go do this quick. I'm going to head back that way. Never mind. You you, you can't. Uh, I can't even go that way. Uh-oh. Kind of stuck on this ledge. Do you flip? This thing doesn't even move. Yeah. That's, that's going to make this navigation thing pretty hard. Uh, do I have less encounters on? Good. Good. Ah, uh, so I'm guessing I have to hit a switch to get these to flip. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go all the way around. Oh, you know what? It, this is faster. There. Oh, that was totally planned, I swear. Okay. I feel a boss. I don't know why. Yeah, I 
did too. She said something about not killing the goddess, right? Yeah. What did she mean? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Two of them. Fire and ice giraffes. <laughs> Pacos loot. Luba light. Comet. Oh, big stagger. Right out of the gates. Uh, I think we can just kill it. Uh, I'm gonna. Might as well meteor javelin it. Oh, volume. Uh, Yule is talking right now. Uh, I can't. <laughs> I can't understand her at all. Split. Launch him. <laughs> oh, good. Was he going to make another Luvalite? Oh, I'm having a coughing fit here. I can feel it. Change the flow. The blocks have changed position. Uh -oh. Looks like we can cross. Looks like. But I haven't made that decision. You can't make it for me. Yep, chaos blocks. Uh, manipulate the blocks to change the way they move and create new routes. Look for patterns. Watch your step. Etc. All right. Uh, now it's going to let me actually go back, I think. Yeah. It'll, it'll let me go over here and up to the right to the next goal. But I have to go back, back. All right. I activated the cactar on this side, so I should be able to just, like, run over here. Oh. Ooh, you're new. I think. Mimi. Let's see if we can get them. Speaking of that, we also have Twilight Odin. Twilight. Wait, block? Oh, it's not. It's not block. Oh! Oh, it's summoned a. Ugh. Proto Behemoth. Don't you stand up. Don't don't you do it. Oh, oh we killed it. <laughs> wow. That was very, very close. Okay. Phoenix mud. That's good. That's good. So, basically, we just have to interact with this. Or stand on that and go to that platform, and I'm just going to jump off the ledge. It'll send me back to the cactar. Oh, but we have to go down there. Never mind. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So we gotta wait for this to flip. Alright. I, I still think I can just jump off the edge after this. There shouldn't be any reason to switch this. Oh man, again? Alright. 
Brawler's wristband? No. Sixteen percent. Oh. <laughs> Uh, if I could make a delicate version of this. I don't know if it'd be better than the power wristband, though. Honestly. It just just because of its cost. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not trying to min-max this game. Like, I, I absolutely would love to. Okay, that sent us back here. I would absolutely love to, but... During a, during a Let's Play, you, you really don't have time for that. <laughs> I I'm happy with whatever abilities my Choco has on, etc. You know, uh, as as long as we can get through all the stuff and and see it. Really, this thing turns quite slow. I suppose that's good if I need to get up the stairs and get to the other side. So, I feel like I'm just waiting at a bus stop. They're waiting for the, the light to change. Uh, are you gonna flip? Oh. Oh, this is unfortunate. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what? Okay, so I gotta sit here, but I don't think I'll be able to make it. Okay, it's about to turn. We'll see. We'll see how far away this is. That's pretty far away. I don't think you can make that jump. So how do I get... I feel like I have to just stand on that, wait for it to spin and jump to stay on it. That's that's all I can really do. Cause th this isn't this isn't happening. Yeah. No. There's no way this is the right way. <clears throat> it can't be. But as soon as it starts moving... Which should be soon. I, it, it works. Uh, I suppose. <clears throat> okay, so with that active, I'm actually going to go back on here. And get to that staircase over there. Wh which way does it turn? Oh, that's kind of a important note that I totally forgot about. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't think I'll make it, but I'm gonna try. Good. I just had to, I had to mark that on the map. Now we now we can just jump off. All right, moving forward. Uh. Ooh. Oh, it's gonna flip the other way now. I see. I haven't fought you, or is this a panda poda? Okay. Uh, flip. Flip. Oh man, you're making me wait so long. Flip. Does this thing not move anymore? Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, this is by far the most complicated area to navigate if you want to get your travel guide. What are you? That's okay. I think that's a mana garmer or whatever they're called. Cutscene? Oh. Okay, let's see if we can even... We'll set you... I think that thing spins in a circle? No. No, I've reduced encounters on. This shouldn't even be happening. I'm going to step over here. Oh, but you're not going to be able to reach. That flips like that, I think, yeah. Damn. There we go. Alright, now the question is, where is this actually going to lead? Or do I just jump off the ledge again? Oh, just just a chest. That's fine. 
I really want to get this out of the way now, so we can just pick up that fragment and call it. Shaman smart. Oh, man. I've been waiting all game for that. Wonder if you can just... Nope. Nope, you actually... You can fall off, but only at these, these locations. There we go. Alright. Does this still spin? It does. Oh, we're... Before it was going clockwise. Now we're going counter. Seems like we just want to get off to one side. Oh my god, this is... It's not even that bad. I actually kind of like this area, but... It is quite tedious. Alright, sisters. Uh, no! Oh. You know what? It's, that's the only way to do it, actually. Hmm. I wonder if I hit... Get me out of here! Uh, does that staircase even move? No, everything, everything with like... It's, it's hard to tell what's moving. I don't think that staircase moves at all. So I'll have to use the cube to get up there. But... What about over there? I wonder if you would just float everywhere, if that that doesn't count for your your uh, encounter rate. That would be an interesting thought. Why are you so loud? I don't think this staircase is moving. Really? That can't be. Maybe that staircase is moving now. Yeah, that one's moving. That one is not. It just doesn't move? Like, if, if I float over here, it doesn't count as a footstep. So I think by doing this, you won't get any encounters. Maybe. I'm not sure if that's how the game works, but that would be an interesting, interesting way to go about it. I'm, I'm gonna try it. No, no, it does. Okay. Uh, there is a cactar here, though. Ooh, and you're new. Apkalu. Uh, where? Yeah, yep. Yeah, yeah, you're you're dead. I'm. Oh, and I got you. I did not. I'm a little too strong. Okay. My goal? I don't know if this thing spins, because they take so long, you, you can't tell. I'm guessing they don't. But I need to get down there. So, if I can get this thing to spin, I can fall down and then jump off and come back up. There we go. It's like a eerie high pitch going on here. Uh, Elixir, thank you. Uh, I'll make sure to totally use that. I never use them. I don't I don't know why, I just can't. Alright, don't turn, don't turn. Just wait one more second. There we go. Wait. Oh, the thing's turned off. <laughs> it can't turn like this. I see. I think this will actually keep it in place, so I want to flip it and then pause it. Okay. Um. Right up here. There's like. 
there's totally something in the middle here. Uh, the, the platform in the middle isn't on the map. Oddly enough. It looks like you can't even get there. Interesting. Let's fight you. You're new. Get him. Monogarmer. You got a big stagger gauge. Wow. And... Oh. Oh, we got him. Wow, that skill makes makes this so easy to get monsters. I swear. Uh, I don't think you can physically get to this one. Just, just based off of... It doesn't seem to be part of the map. I think you're just meant to throw Mug. Vitality booster. You did it. Okay, so we're gonna go up there to the left. Hit the switch and that'll flip the staircase. And then we'll have two more... Two more tiers and we're done. It's such a weird but short final dungeon. This, this whole waiting for... Waiting for these, though. Not, not the most fun mechanic. I could get off here. But I don't... No, no, we, we have to go back there anyway. There, there's an, a marker there. Okay, don't turn. Um, oh. Oh, it's just telling us to go forward. Okay. I'm gonna activate this. Jump to this. And it's mapped. Might as well fall. Oh, wow. Now, I need to be able to turn this to get up there, I think. No, that actually reaches up there. That's, that's farther ahead. Oh, there's, there's a platform on the bottom. It's, it's exactly the same as the other side, I see. No battle. Royal armlet. I have like five of those now. Uh, they are. They have pretty good defense, though. That's for sure. Okay, I have to wait for this to. Okay, we're good now. Which let that turn. Don't turn yet. You, you better just. Nope. Nope. There we go. Looks like we are actually almost at the top. You're gonna flip that way, right? Please don't flip towards that chest. Well, that's that sucks. Uh, how would I do this? If I freeze. Oh no, I I actually don't know how I'm gonna hit a cube to get this to go the other way. Like That's that's a little awkward. Alright, we're gonna have to do the whole thing where we jump at the right time. Looks like there's one over there too. Mm, that way. Uh, well, that's a big gap. That's 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 too big. I can't make that. 
Oh, that's off the map. Oh, I guess if it's not part of the map, then I would just have to throw Mog. That's that's fine then. Okay. All right. It's flipping the right way. I don't think I'm going to be able to reach it with Mog, though. Yeah, no. Damn. Which means I needed to have it flip the other way to be able to stand that close and then throw Mog. I don't know if I'm going to do that for this accessory. Oh, wait. If I move... The mod clock will just drop. Mod, where are you? Oh. Thought I glitched you. Oh. What are these cats? I took out the behemoth, but these things are literal tanks. Saboteur. They're taking, like, zero damage. They should be sentinels, honestly. Uh, how much actual health do you have? 7,000 health. Just massive defense. Interesting. This is weird. Uh, this, this thing is, uh, okay, it's a little more weak to commandos, I guess. I couldn't do anything to it, though. That was rough. And I got one. Too bad Saboteur really doesn't... I don't, I don't really need a monster Saboteur, honestly. Okay. Well, we're almost there. I do want to go around and search the other side, though, so I'll probably do that quick. Exist. The world without you is no world at all. No. I do not have the power to stop you. The choice must be yours, and yours alone. Even if the future you choose is doomed. Uh, she was just telling us, uh, t telling us to, th that the future was bright and etc. So that must have changed recently. We already grabbed that, right? Yeah. Uh, what is this big red one? Uh, I'll check it after. other anymore? I guess I shouldn't be too sad. After all, it's been fun talking to you. I also got to help you out on your journey. Don't look at me like that. You're gonna make me cry. Smile! Choco Bocolina! Aww. Choco Lina's goodbye. Alright. Uh, we actually have money this time, but still, I there's really nothing I can buy. I did want to check. Durable De de delicate. Oh, it's it's 40. So 14 versus 8. I mean, you could literally only wear two Shaman's Marks if you got two of them. And that'd be 28 versus 4 Magician Mark, which is 24. But you don't, you don't get the stat stuff. Or no, that's 32. What am I... 32... 
Plus, you get the passive stat for buff duration, etc. You know, the vampiric strikes. I can't see a world where wearing these, delicate or durable, would beat it. Well, actually, this would be 40 strength. If you wore two durable, and that's it. 40 strength. But no passives on it. Technically, you could have a higher stat if you do that. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how much better it would actually be. Buff duration, though, actually, it might be better, honestly, to do two durable shaman marks. But not, not brawler, because vampiric strikes is so good. <sighs> okay, so I just made one, but I, you can't get you. I don't even have two shamans. Oh, we, we've we've had that line. I, I can't even have two, so that kind of like ruins it a little bit because I have to take two of these off, which is sixteen percent, so that I get an extra four percent by wearing this. And I have 25% left. Wait. I have zero left. What am I talking about? I gain a little increase, and I only lose 5% of my buff duration, which isn't that bad for her. I think. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, what does this do? No. That's what you were saying. We could head back now if we wanted to. If that's your decision, then I won't stop you. I'm behind you all the way. It's your call. I'm not going back. All right, I'm gonna go map off this side. Then we're gonna go up, and then we're gonna, we're gonna go turn in the map. Okay. The siren is quite loud. Are they starting to launch already? Well, we better get moving. Cocoon is just ahead. Mm, mm -hmm. uh, before we step up there, 100% explored. Okay. Ah, so this is the current layout of academia. Current layout, my ass. It's a future layout. Thanks to you, our data banks are now fully restored. We should be able to normalize the network now. So tell me, did you find out what happened? To put it simply, an influx of illogical data provided an entry point for the paradox and the restored data closed that entry off right will this help you to stop the other malfunctions we're still not sure at the very least we've stopped the corruption from spreading i don't know what we would have done without your generous cooperation hmm well oh, academic rank paradox professor all right that puts th uh, oh that actually finishes monster bits almost academic and we're done with Academia. And then we have Bestiary Paradox. Uh, this is related to the ending, I think. Yeah. Battle Mania. Chocobo music. Just wanted to pick these up quick. Change music heard. Oh, uh, crazy Chocobo. Chocobo's a pulse. Interesting. Chocobo race. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Increase the counter rate and counter rate of powerful enemies. Ooh. Wow, this this also This is gonna be good for when I have to finish out the bestiary. Interesting. Okay, okay. Well, we picked those up. We're only missing four skills now. Alright. Start at the end. You, are you watching? I shall fulfill my promise. Your suffering will end. Oh. Hope. 
course you slept for another hundred years. Pilot. <laughs> Hang on up there, you kids. You're on the Saz Express to the sky. <laughs> Take her up, Dad. <laughs> Wait. Wait, the chocobo in his hair. That's not Chocolina, is it? That doesn't make any sense. I, I could have sworn it was Chocolina. Dodge even named her. Uh, well, I... Didn't that make Chocolina a paradox? Is that you? Hey, Sarah! Dodge says he misses your classes. Friend of yours? We can catch up later. First, we've got a plan to save. This is it. A fight for the future. You want to see how well you've trained me? Oh my god, the sound effects. It's funny, I, I thought they were the protagonist, but apparently the wind is the protagonist. Because the wind got a much higher uh, decibel level. I have to complain about the sound all the way to the end. Alright. It's... it's... We oh. Weak to be shell. Take this. Get him. Ow. I don't think this is working. This. Get him. You really need two saboteurs to make this useful. Well, it's up there. Thanks, buddy. There we go. Let's see if we can get him parallel again. Get him! Now! Take this! Is it weak to imperil? It is. Good call. Thank now. you. Come on! This should do it! Get him! God, he is way out there. Uh-oh. Come on. I have zero wound potions. Cerberus. Destroyed him. I don't know if you noticed, but I had to pick use a random n n uh, name generator. Uh, Gilgamesh. That's that Chocobo's name. Save your future, you will not survive to see it. I know the truth, Caius. I know that every time I change things, I lose a part of my life. Don't you see? I don't care. I'm here to protect the future, and I will. How very evil of you, but you shall die first. Okay. We fought him quite a few times. Wait, wait, can we Libra? Really? Um. I need an Asuna. A bunch of Asunas. There we go. 
Uh, we might we might as well buff up because I'm getting interrupted. The shell. There we go. What do you got against Sarah? He protect. Come on. There we go. Oh, good thing I have Sentinel on. All right. Uh, use him. Oh, chain break. That's a lot of buffs. He's also got regen on. Face your worst fear. Again? Oh. Oof. You fight bravely to protect your friends. Like a true guardian. What about you, Caius? You swore the same oath to protect you! <laughs> Everything I do is for you. Her spirit is bound by a curse. I will see. What curse? How many Yules have you met on this journey? The jewel of the Farseers is reincarnated without end in every age. Think what that means. Her only purpose is to die over and over. Even though she can see the future, she's not allowed to escape her fate. She is born knowing that she will die before she has truly lived. Countless deaths without a life to give them meaning. No matter how great the sacrifice, they shall destroy time and fate itself. Then your spirit shall be free. No! No! How did we do that? Uh oh. We can catch him. No hope, not you. But what about? You have to protect the Neil and Fang. You're right. I'll see you on the new cocoon. Don't be late. Okay. Count on it. This isn't goodbye. Yeah, we'll be there. And Lightning will be with us. Take care. Okay, kids. Let's do this. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh. Don't worry, Dodge. They'll be back. <laughs> okay. And here we go. That's the correct volume. I, lo I love how Saz gets, like, the correct mixing going on here. Ah, they're just making it realistic. You couldn't hear when you're shouting from ship to ship. Send us a present. She's watching you try to save the future and lending you a hand. Not just me. She's helping you too, Noel. This is a cool, cool arena. I like this. Destiny's power never 
Uh, Choco Butt, get out of the way. <laughs> uh oh. Wow, that did like zero damage. Oh, the music. Big boost. Oh. <laughs> You're lucky, you almost got meteor javelined. Think. Was it really a curse? Was it forced on her by Etro? Do you really think that you wanted to die and not come back? <laughs> of course not. You wanted to come back. Every time she died in your arms, she wanted to come back. She knew her next life would be short. She knew! Because she wanted to see you. Again, and again, without end. <laughs> Enough no more. Lies! Why won't you believe me? <laughs> oh. this it 
it's up to you to keep hope alive. Okay, I may have forgot what the final boss actually was in this game. I thought it was Caius, but I guess I'm wrong. <laughs> How did this happen? I guess we'll see well, what, what their names are and stuff. They're pretty badass, though. Good. Garnet, Bahamut, Amber. I see. The spell. It didn't work. I guess we focus Garnet. Okay, that it's not bad damage. I should probably save Ultimate Arrow and all that for the one in the back, but. Four fifty nine. Uh, you mean everything? I don't know yet. It is not okay. Oh, this thing's so dead. Hold on, hold on. Oh! Oh, it's over. Or, restarted. I just wanted to hear the music with all the sound effects, or without them. This is an, I really like this song. Asuna, Asunata, yay. I think you can only get that from Flanander and it's AoE Asuna. Very rare. Okay, uh, D shell. It can be D shell. Jeez. Come on. Man, what are your odds? There we go. Alright, alright, alright. Now, Ultima Arrow. And then during that... It's weird, you have to time that or it waits. It's interesting. Ooh, chaos seeds. What, what was that about? Okay. A little painful. It's so strong.
told me that Yule is reborn because of me, then I have to die. We must free Yule. Kill me. You're the only one that can end this eternal torment. Even if it were for Yule's sake, I wouldn't want to kill you. Lightning is dead. I killed her with my own hands. Will you allow me to go unpunished? He's lying. <laughs> In Valhalla, time does not flow as it should. Long before we began our battle here, I had already faced her. Now, she sleeps never to wake. Things that shall happen in your future have already been decided in my own past. I know how it begins and how it ends. Then you should know you can't provoke me. No matter how hard you try, I'm not going to kill you. <laughs> That's right. You hate to kill anyone, don't you? No, born at the end of days. You understand the true value of life. Know this. You will kill me, no. Oh. The moment I cease to exist, you shall be released from her fate. Show mercy, finish him. Oh, God. Uh. Do it. <laughs> that's that's not Impressive. what I'm <laughs> No. He who can change time must choose between those who die and those who live. You must bear the burden. No. The eternal paradox. <laughs> Illusion of choice. Show Mercy did the same thing. No. He always wanted to come back here, didn't he? He wanted to come back here to die. He thought if he did, he could end Yule's cycle of rebirth. This way, all the Yules that are called back to Valhalla, they can be with him here. They don't have to return to be born again. He heard you. In the end, he believed what you told him. This is a world that gives birth to infinite possibilities. But that's all there are. Possibilities. There's no death here, but no real life either. The Yules that returned to this place chose a different fate. They wanted to be born again. They didn't need immortality. They wanted reality. But Caius wanted something different. Something he thought was better than life. A dream where he could protect the spirits of all the Yules forever. But I'm not like him. I'm going to find her. Find my Yule. It doesn't have to be forever. Just... I want to be with her in the future. Then, let's do it. Build a new future. Yeah. I never wanted to hurt anyone. I didn't want to lose my Yule. I didn't want to lose any of them. No one deserves to die. Mm -hmm. Not even you, friend. Farewell. Oh, boy. 
it's funny that I chose finish him because show mercy would 100% be what I always choose. Then the timeline is back to how it was. Sarah, feeling okay? Can the timeline change? Did you see anything? I mean, did you feel any pain? No, I feel great. Hmm. Good. Why don't we go and find lightning? Okay. I don't think she's here, Kubel. Wait, you don't think that Caius really... No, that was just a lie. Now that the timeline is fixed, she's back in her own world. I bet she's waiting for you, along with everyone else. The paradoxes are resolved. The gates will disappear soon. We better hurry on back. Right. So this will take us to 500 AF. I guess that's where we'll be living now. 500 years in my future. Maybe lightning will be there. I suppose they don't have. They don't have a choice. The future lightning fought to protect. It's the start of a brand new era. What about Fang and Vanille? They'll be there for sure. And don't forget, Hope is in that time as well. Once the gates disappear, everyone stays where they are. Every day, we'll be able to look into the sky and see the new cocoon above us. I bet Snow will be waiting there, Kubo. <laughs> Snow. Better hope so. We'll see, that'll be up to lightning, I think. Yeah? <laughs> Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Now, I'm about 50-50 whether I have to mute this part. So if it's completely muted, uh, there the only reason why would be is if it's blocked. Basic fissures detected in the pillar. Collapse is imminent. Rescue team report. Hold on. Switching displays. We're pulling out. Not this part. Come on, Saz. We've got Vanille and Fang. Their crystal is intact. Bringing them home. <sighs> Great work. Nice. Thank you, Saz. Thank you for saving them. They've kept our world safe for centuries. But now they can rest and join us in our new ark. Paradox levels are holding. Sir, they're not coming down. The gates haven't been shut down yet, which means the timeline must still be unstable. Director? It's okay. Sarah and Noel will fix it. They just need more time. <laughs> the pillar is coming down! This part. This part may be muted. If it is, then... Apologies. Oh, there, there, there'll still be subtitles. If not, then just, it's fine. It's just that, uh, usually the Final Final Fantasy songs, or the ending theme is, if it's blocking in, in Japan, then I don't like that. Uh, I don't care about the, 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 the claim part, but if it's blocked and people in Japan couldn't watch my videos, then it seems unfair. There it goes. Where's the new one? That's basically a whole that whole ass world. Oh, there's the new one. Why? Why'd they keep the holes? <laughs> this song is absolutely amazing though, so... I recommend looking up the ending <laughs> if you've never played and this is muted. Very fitting for this. This is our ark, our haven. It will be called Benevelza, 
and it shall be the new home for the human race. So many holes in it. Uh. Having a dream, basking in the sun. I'm starting to think that I'm so here. Oh, can I pause to hurt me? What's your plan? Hey! Uh. Look, the hero's in the back. It says. Nice catch. <laughs> Welcome so, home. <laughs> Thanks. That is not how gotcha. that would happen. <laughs> You're okay now. Are you feeling all right? Good to see everyone again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh. The gates are closed. It's the end of our journey. Credits. <clears throat> hey, no. Thank you. Sarah. No, not now, please. Sarah, snap out of it. No! No. Sarah. And now the music doesn't really fit. Fine. The future changed. It changed. If you change the future, you change the past. The effects ripple outwards, up and down the timeline. The Sirius is forced to see it all. You mean Sarah? She saw this vision? Yes. And it killed her. Sarah. Oh boy. She knew the risk. If we altered the future, she knew what would happen. That her life could be in danger. She still chose to save it. I wanted to protect her. <sighs> I thought I had. I thought she was safe. <sighs> but it only gets worse. Stop beating. The goddess will die once again. I killed the goddess? 
dies, the chaos of Valhalla is unleashed. The chaos has the power to warp the timeline and destroy the past. You know how upset I was when I saw To Be Continued? <laughs> that, uh, that... That that was definitely, like... Well, I wasn't upset, but... I, I don't know. I don't know. If they would have if they would have just... They really, really tried hard to cliff, cliffhanger you there. And I had no idea what, what was supposed to come next. I don't even think we had to wait that long before Lightning Returns. Uh, which the the title of the game immediately kind of spoiled <laughs> the the game itself or what you know this stuff lightning returns at but either way I remember that ending that ending actually uh, made me tear up quite a bit the first time I did it just because like I thought everything was fine and it, it threw me for a loop you know when she actually did die uh, this time obviously I remembered <laughs> and th that's not exactly something I can forget and I've, I actually think I've watched that ending multiple times you know like five or five or six times so I'm very familiar with it but yep everything has gone to shit literally all of our work throughout the game kind of backfired uh, if we if we hadn't gone chasing after lightning, no one would have killed Caius, and the world would, you know, stay in a state. Not maybe not the original state, but it would have stayed in a state. Now everything is Valhalla. Time does not exist. Like history is just gone. There was the theme song. <laughs> oh, English voice. Laura Bailey, amazing. Troy Baker. I can't read all these. I'm just looking for ones I know. Steve Bloom. Steve Bloom was a multiple people. Liam O'Brien. Ali Hillis. Oh, there's a lot of names in here I recognize. Nolan North was in this? Where? Interesting. Yuri Lowenthal, I heard him many times. Best Spider-Man. Fight me. Okay. Well... That is, that is that for for the actual you know story on this. I think, uh, like like I mentioned with the whole mercy versus finish him option that I had at the end, it doesn't matter. In fact, I don't think anything changes. Uh, he always stops, and you know, like it said, finish him. He didn't even try. He said he was you know he was going to show mercy regardless, which made my point pointless. But. I think the only reason I wanted to pick finish him is because I remembered that he died in the true ending or the ending in general. So I'm like, I don't want to mess it up and, you know, choose mercy and suddenly not get the ending somehow. So I'm pretty sure choosing mercy does the same thing, though. Oh, do we get to hear the full song? You know, I might, I might boost the music here in the, the credits just because... Now that there's no sound effects, you can actually enjoy them. Uh, minus my voice. I mean, if I just talk from back here, it's probably okay, you know? I don't I don't mean to overpower every game I play by having, a, you know, my voice in there, but <laughs> it's it's kind of it's kind of unavoidable sometimes. 
Uh, especially, I, I just really, I, this is this is my favorite song. I wonder if it's. Are you gonna go into the full version or? No, it just switched. Oh man. That song is so atten intense. It really sets up like every, uh, you know, every every tense moment in the game quite well. I, I don't care what anyone says. I know Nobuo Omatsu, Uematsu is not part of this, but they still they still did a good job. I mean, half the people are just like blind loyalists when when it comes to you know saying. He didn't do it. Shit game. I've, I've heard so many people say that, and I'm like, you're literally hating on the music because he didn't do it? I mean, it's one thing if you hate on it because it's you don't like it. You know? That's, that's your opinion. But just because the person who did your childhood favorite game didn't do this makes it bad? I, I mean, I love all, the, all of his music, and I love all this music too I also love all of 14's music and well he helped out with some of those but Soken did most of that and he does a great job I'm very excited for Endwalker <laughs> just just to hear the new music if anything uh, so as for this uh, playing it on Steam kind of made things awkward I don't know if it's just because it's on PC or my setup is really weird and it caused even recording issues to be, you know, uh, bad with the sound. The sound was the biggest issue for me in this game. I could not, for the life of me, get, get, get over it. Like, every time I heard a sound effect that just... Like, like I try to cut them down and make them equal when I, when I edit, but it's really hard because you've got to take everything down. You, I, I don't get to just pick and choose and say, hey, let's lower the sound effect here. No, I gotta lower the whole damn section, and uh, that—that's—it's kind of rough uh, having to do that and not not being able to just balance it in game. But I've noticed that a lot of things I play kind of have big tones like that. So I don't know if it's just because I'm getting older I'm noticing that, or my PC setup is bad and like sound effects are just way louder all of a sudden. Uh, I don't know how that would work, but. Uh, all over the internet, they always they, they they talk about this game having audio problems. Like if you don't if you don't have the right setup, you're you're gonna hear completely different what other than what other people hear. Because the first time I played it, I, what, I everything sounded fine. I just don't know if it was because I was a kid or because of my setup. Because I played it on PS3 with the surround sound, and that completely changes it. You know. So, it was it was a problem. Like there are parts uh, watching back on the, you know, on all the episodes I've recorded, where I just you just can't hear the voices, and I'm like, why, why? Then I realized no one watches these, so <laughs> it's not really a big deal if it's not done perfectly. And plus, there's nothing I can do about it, anyways. Not really. So sound was a big issue for me. Uh, graphics seemed to hold up pretty damn well. There were some flickery spots in there, but it's not like I can do anything about that either. Uh, I could add mods to try to improve it, but I feel like that stuff was just in the game. Uh, how, how, it, how it's always been. And I'm not really too, you know, hell-bent on making something look amazing uh, because sometimes it's just too much I, I like the the flaws you know the the flickering bad reflections everything that came with the game it it's fine it's fine we don't we don't need to upgrade if they want to do a remaster and make everything perfect I'll play it uh, and I'll probably love it but I'm, I'm fine with the imperfections too but yeah, it, it seems to hold up pretty damn well. As as for that part. There are a lot of RNG moments in this game, though, that I absolutely... Like, there's there's RNG in Final Fantasy everywhere. You know, low drop chance, uh, certain battles on a certain planet... Or, not planet. 
certain rock in the sky where where you you're running around at like one in one in I don't even remember what it was one in sixty four chance to run into it and then a one in forty eight chance that, that it drops a, an item that that's usually bad but when you have RNG and quizzes it makes me want to I don't know not not rage quit but <laughs> I'm not, I'm not really someone who rage quits, but you know what I mean. Like, it, it makes me just want to not support that part of it. Some of the RNG just needs to go. and It never will. That's, it's part of the game. I have to deal with it. Like, like f forcing me to do slots and win a bunch of money for this last fragment that I'm going to need. Not, not excited for that. <laughs> you have unlocked Paradox Scope. It's time to head to the, the Mystic Resident... Resi Mystic, reciting in serendipity. This fragment skill will give you the courage to face challenges you thought were impossible. You will find yourself being able to destroy enemies you should have no chance of defeating. Switch this on and close all the gates in the historic, cl cl ah, Historia Crux to reset locations and challenge yourself to achieve the impossible. Oh. Controller died. We good? Oh, you put me right on the timeline. A new Serendipity, a new Coliseum, a new Valhalla. Uh, oh, this just lets you go right to, instead of going through Academia, you can just do the ending section here, I believe. Okay, okay. Uh, let's... What's going on back here? Serendipity. It was a place that ancient minstrels sang of in joyous ballads. It was a past is this the DLC? that knew neither day nor night, an endless now of joy and amusement. It was said that only souls who had perished in an unfortunate This is the same night. dialogue. Okay, yeah. I think that's Saz's DLC. It's called Head Heads or Tails. It is said that the arena Perpetual was created in preparation for the day of reckoning. Mighty oh. warriors from every age gather, combatants risen from the grave, and given temporary souls, all... Cl there's Omega. Interesting. Both hope and the future are Requiem so of the good. Goddess. Okay, I've never done this. Plans to you okay. Uh, I'm not. I'm not. I'm gonna do that in a later episode after we do the Paradox endings. So we're gonna do Paradox endings, then all three of these DLC, starting with Saz, then Colosseum, which has to be Snow because he has the DLC, I think, <laughs> and then and then Lightnings clearly here. So. We're going to do all three of those probably in the same episode, depending on how long they are, along with the Paradox endings, so we'll, we'll see if it's one to two episodes, who knows. <laughs> but we're pretty pretty damn close to being totally done with this game, and we'll move on to Lightning Returns, Majora's Mask Edition. Everything's on a timer, and I am going to be a little stressed <laughs> trying to make sure I don't screw it up. But it'll be fine. I'll probably follow a little bit of a guide. I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. But thanks for watching. Let me know if you like it. And I will see you in the next one.